Good morning ladies and gents, our dog here. Welcome to the hunt. Uh, today I'm going to swing around to some parks. We're going to start in this little city park here, then maybe do a sports field, a couple tot lots, whatever we can find. See what we can get out of here today. On to the hunt. 17 under the tree. Oh, okay, I think I know what that is. <coughs> Excuse me. Flattened penny, I think. We will check it out. But I think that's what it is. Could be the uh could be a spinner off a fishing lure too. Fifteen. That'd be a fishing weight. <laughs> Sounds like clad. There it is. One loony. Just a little tip for all you guys, if you ever see two trees like this, I would definitely hunt between them because some people like to put up those slack lines or hammocks and all that kind of stuff, so there's quite often goodies between them. Let's keep going. Nineteen. Beside the picnic table. Oh, look at that. First piece of jewelry for the day. We got another cross. Okay, we'll check that out. We'll clean her up nice. Boy, I sure find have been finding a lot of uh, religious stuff lately. I like it. They make cool jewelry. All right, we'll clean that up. Make it nice again. Nice 1718 here. Sounds almost too good to be true. Just a giant pull tab. Switch to a sports field here for a little while. We got a quarter on our first target. All right, looks like we got a little ring. Tiny, tiny one, a little flower, a little blinger. All right, we got something cool in the grass here. Come on, baby. Hmm. I usually don't have a lot of luck with these ones with the, uh, where you can change the size on here. But I could find nonetheless. Bring up a seven. Probably because of the little pendant. Okay, cool. 
Nice shallow 21 here. What is that? Oh, game token. All right. Well, that's a different kind of pin. London College of Music. Okay, cool. This is day two, starting in the water. It's got a real nice clear high tone here. Sounds like American money. Wow. She was a deep one. All right, we got her. Oh, okay. That's not a coin. What is that? Just some kind of token, I guess? Okay. Weird. Hmm. Flowers, first thing in the morning. Okay, let's keep going. Beautiful 53. Perfect number for Garrett Gold. And pull tabs. Oh, I think I got it. Ah, you suck. Pull tap. Sixty-one, sixty-two. That's weird numbers for Garrett. Nice and clear, though. Oh. Oh boy. Uh, I guess that could be gold, a little diamond. It feels light though. All right, well, it's still a ring. Awesome find. Yeah, 62 is probably too high for, uh, that would be about a 17, 18 on the Knox. All right, well, it's still a ring. Let's keep going. Okay, deep quarter there. Uh, we are still getting some clad, but I think I'm going to go try another beach with a few more targets. So uh, if I don't get anything on the way in, we'll see at the next one. 62 in the scoop. That was a loud one. Now I know why. Okay, some old sunglasses. Cool beans. Okay, this was an 82. That is a uh, smashed up ring. Looks pretty copper, but it um, it looks old, so that's cool. I did not move. I stayed and decided to go down the shoreline instead, which will re probably result in a parking ticket, but uh, got to do what you got to do. Not completely sure here, but I think we got a uh, a very old penny. Yeah, it says one cent on there. That's awesome. King George V. Sweet. All right, there's another target in with this in this hole, so I'm going to go after it. All right, ladies and gents, welcome to the wrap up. Um, not, not my best hunt for sure, but um, not too bad. It was two fairly short hunts, so didn't expect too much, but we did get some cool stuff and we got some precious metals. So what more can we ask for? Uh, slow day on the clad. Uh, more so, I just didn't want to dig after it. It uh, rings up like rusty nails, so um, don't, I don't dig as much clad in the water. But anyway, we got about nine bucks. Not bad. A pair of sunglasses. 
pile of pennies. There ended up being two game tokens in the same hole there. And um, Flattened Penny is from Kauai. And it's some kind of turtle saving um, thing for like donating money to the turtles. That's cool. Not sure on that thing. Some kind of token, good luck token or something like that. Um, the London College pin, that's pretty cool. I think that's kind of like a cufflink with that, the way that's on there. It just kind of goes through your shirt pocket or your coat pocket. So pretty cool, and I believe that's probably London, Ontario, not London, England. Um, the cross, I'm not sure what um, faith or whatever that is. Um, it's got some writing around the middle of the circle there, but it, I think it's Latin. So if anybody recognizes that, I would love to know. And let's go to the bling chain. It's just a blinger. Still a good find, though, in the grass, It's uh, and it's fully intact, which is surprising. We got some cool old pennies. I got into a water spot there that had some old stuff in it. We got a 1933, I think, King George V, 1950 King George VI, and a 1960 Young Liz. So pretty cool. Found some old pennies. And we got three rings. Two of them are blingers. Those two little guys there are blingers. And this one makes a lot of sense now. I, was, I couldn't understand why it rang up so high, thinking it was probably copper or something like that. But it is actually silver. Um, it's so it'd be plated over silver and it is marked 925 and I did test the diamond the diamond is not a diamond but still cool nonetheless good find so that's the hunt um, stay tuned for a sec here and we'll do the draw for the um, CKG uh, finds bag I'll set her up okay so what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna, I'll, I'm just gonna give away both prizes so first place we'll be able to choose between the finds bag or the um, woven silver ring so first place we'll get to choose and second place we'll get the other one so let's get with it and the winner is Corey the treasure hunter awesome very glad been supporting my channel for a long time has an awesome channel of his own so that's perfect um, think I actually already have your address, so that'll be an easy one. Okay, let's go pick another winner. And second place will be Mike Schramm. Congratulations, Mike Schramm. Send me your address. Um, my email's on my About page. And uh, just send it out, and I will send you whichever one uh, Corey doesn't choose. So that is the video. Thank you all so much for joining me. See you on the next one.